You're watching Telecom TV from the MEF Annual Members Meeting in Boston. And I'm joined now by Mary Stanhope, who's VP of Marketing at Global Capacity. Mary, thanks for joining us on Telecom TV. Thanks for having me, Guy. This is a pretty great event. Can I ask, um, to start with, um, what would you say are the most significant developments that have been shaping the, the wholesale services market over the past year? Yeah, you know, it quite simply is Ethernet. But really, in the wholesale market, it's that all of us as service providers are working better at Ethernet and working together end-to-end -end at Ethernet. And what do you think the, the impact of, of new emerging services such as SD-WAN um, and Universal CPE, what, 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 what the impact has been? Yeah, you know, the emergence of SD-WAN, I'm going to use that one because it's pretty exciting and it's touching all areas from applications to equipment to networks. And it's about creating a new hybrid network. It's changing and really focusing on the customer and where they need to go and their destination and the best way to connect them. So you're choosing lots of different technologies, Ethernet, Internet, wireless, bringing it together for a hybrid network that solves the customer problem. And that means as service providers, we're all working more and more together. So the new developments we're seeing in automation and the delivery of, of, of agile services, this is, this is really changing the nature of the market, is it? It really is, and it's at the edge. We really need to think more and more of the edge, which is very interesting because all the data and applications are moving to the core and into data centers. So it poses a very interesting challenge from an enterprise network on how we solve and connect that edge piece and enablement to the data and the applications that are key for every business. You, you bring this up, so how, how do you do it? How, how, what's the best way to go about this? Yeah, global capacity solves the problem with a marketplace of networks. We actually interconnect network service providers, cable, copper, fiber, and provide a full range of access connectivity to as many buildings and commercial locations as we can and then preset interconnects back to data centers, cloud providers, and application providers to streamline that turn up and automate that service delivery. So there's some examples of innovative services that Global Capacity is introducing. Is this because customer expectations are changing? You know, Guy, customer expectations, particularly from enterprise, are changing. The networks they need are changing. And because of this, in this digital world and global businesses, data centers, new applications, and everything working together, the needs of the network need to be more intelligent and they need to be higher bandwidth and better performance. So how will the adoption of, of new networking technologies, such as we're seeing here at the, the MEF event, a lot of focus on LSO, how, how, how will this impact the wholesale market over the coming years? Yeah. The impact of LSO to the wholesale market is really focused on getting us all to work better together. It shortens the order time, it shortens the delivery time. And you think of that end user and you think of the world we're in today, it's all about instant turn up. So it allows us to reach a better customer satisfaction. And once that service is up, and we're all making our revenue on it, because let's be honest, we sell network services, but the businesses are being satisfied, the businesses are achieving what they need, but we're also able to manage that service end-to-end -end and provide the best performance. So overall, it's about customer experience, working together, and getting that end-to-end -end service to look like a single service. And what would you say are some of the opportunities and challenges associated with the MEF's drive towards its, its vision of, of third network services? Yeah. Some of the overall challenges of the third network go right back to getting us all to work together as one large network. Global capacity is a marketplace of networks where we interconnect networks. We kind of face some of these challenges in our everyday business, uh, getting the body to come together and think about how they're going to do things and standardize in a market that's very innovative with service providers that are innovative and looking to differentiate will always be a challenge. And a final question for you. Yeah. Um, how important is the work that the, the MEF continues to do? Yeah. MEF's continued focus on bringing all the service providers together, on creating standards that everyone can use to talk and work together, continues to lead all of us to a better end-to-end -end solution and to a better enterprise business connectivity solution. Mary, thank you very much indeed. You're welcome.